White Run, White Run, it's a wonderful town. Mm. Ah, it's good to be back. After that rather lengthy journey, I think we'll get some rest, some food in our bellies, and then tomorrow we can think about heading on in the Windhelm direction. Come on in. We got warm food, warm drinks, and warm beds. Marvelous. Hello again, Hulda. It's what you need. How about shopping up some wood for the fires? Ah, I'd like to see what you have for sale, actually. Let's sate that appetite, hmm? Yes, please. Apple cabbage stew always goes down very nicely. And some bread. Oh, and cheese. I can never get enough cheese. That'll do marvelously. Thank you very much. Oh, oh, actually... Oh, I am tempted. Go on, just to treat myself. Thank you. Now, I'd quite like to rent a room. Do you think you can sure manage thing. It's yours for not a day. to watch me during the night? I'll show you to your room, right this way. That would be great. I'm sorry, do you have to hark inside? Literally here in an inn? You're doing your shouting thing? Most uncouth. Shush. Citizens, be aware. Shush. Dragon spotted in the region. Right, I'll just, uh, I'll just leave you to it then. Yes. Hello there. Sorry, excuse me, Hulda. Come on. Come along, let's let Hulda through. Sorry about this, madam. There we are. I enjoy this work I'd well like enough, to but I'm ready to retire. I've been thinking of setting right. the entry solda. Anyway, what do you need? Perch here. Have a little snack. Mm -mm. <laughs> Delicious. Sweet rolls are marvelous. Yeah. Yeah. Right then. Do you know, while I'm here, I think I'll try figuring out these other spell tomes. You know, Oak Flesh and Bone Spirit. Let's see if we can figure out what to do with those. Now, where are we? Yes, Oak Flesh and Bone Spirit. Let's give them a go. Now, uh. oh. Oak Flesh. Yeah! Gosh, look at that! Look at my hands! Oh, that feels most peculiar! Very peculiar indeed! Hello! Yes, come in, come in, come and get settled! We ought to come up with a name for you at some point. Can't just go around calling you... Thing? Peculiar looking... Creature? Anyway, this Bone Spirit spell then. Yeah. Ooh. Doesn't really seem to do anything. Which is great, because as I understand from the tome, it's only supposed to have an effect on the undead. Ooh. Gosh, it made a light down there. So it does seem to launch some kind of projectile. Only on undead. Right then. Time for sleep, I think. See you in the morning, little friend. <clears throat> Good morning, peculiar little thing whose name we haven't yet come up with. Where are we sleeping? Gore? And more importantly, what are we eating? Um, we just slept. Wherever you are. But uh, I hope you did too. I hope you didn't spend all night down here. And our breakfast, let's see. Splendid. 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 Oh, and go on then. Let's have a second sweet roll. Thank you. Proclamations, tidings, advertisements. I announce it all. Yes, you rather do, don't you? Rather loudly. Hmm. Right, let's go and find a carriage. Be parked up in the usual place, I expect. Oh, 
Hello again. It's that unusual chap. Uh, don't mind him. Let's just keep walking, people. Let's just keep walking. Hopefully he doesn't try and talk to us. Good morning, sir. Horse. Talk to my father, Skullbar. Yes, I would get a horse, but, well, I've not had the best luck with riding them before. But perhaps one day. Ah, yes, there's the carriage. Now, where's the driver? Probably sheltering from this rain. Ah, there he is. Hello, good sir. Good morning. I'd like to hire your carriage. Where do you want to go? Windhelm, please. Uh, oh, but you want the whole... Uh, perhaps East March? Going straight through, or did you want to stop somewhere? It is East, after all. Uh, yes, take me straight to Windhelm. Climb back, and we'll be off. Marvelous. Uh, are you coming? No? Uh, shall I just... I'll just wait in the car, right? Yes, I'll just wait here. And I'm sure you'll be along... Any moment. Any moment now. Gosh, it's a bit chilly here. Oh, goodness! They just killed those soldiers! It's another battle! It's another battle! We need to get out of here, we need to run! We need to get clear! Heavens, horses! Whew. Come on, come on, come and hide! That's it, let's just, let's just all duck down here and let the battle pass. Is it over? I hope so. Yes, it's over, but the storm cloak is just standing there. Hmm. Let's just take a moment to check the map. Figure out where we're going to find these seducers. Like to take on a dragon shouter in battle, I make it a rule not to fight friends. But this Ulfric is a stranger to me. Yes, he certainly is a disagreeable chap. I wouldn't necessarily walk straight into the city and try and fight him. I don't know how well that would go down. Anyway, the map. Let's see... Yes, now this is roughly where they said the Seducers Bandit Camp should be. So if we just follow the road up, we should get there. Well, let's set off. Stay well clear of those soldiers. There we go. I think we're safe. Look at all this snow! Oh! <gasps> Heavens! Is that a dragon? Maybe it won't see us. Will it just fly over? Gosh! Let's not attack until it does. Look at it go! Fascinating. Is it just circling? It could just be on its way. Yes? Yes, it seems to be leaving. Thank goodness for that. Gosh, it's getting rather chilly. Do you know, I'm not quite sure we'll make it along that road. Perhaps we'd better find somewhere to warm up. Back to the city? Yes. Back to the city. I didn't want to stay. But it seems we might not have much choice. Whew. Gosh. <sighs> really? Gets you quickly, doesn't it? <sighs> Heavens. Look at all that blood. Do you know, I don't know that I'll make it to the city gate. Can I... can I shelter in here? I hope you don't mind, sir. If I could just 
get in the house? Gosh, soldier. Got a lot of nerve walking around here. Do you mind if I just? Whew. That's much better. I'm so sorry to intrude. Would you mind awfully if my companions and I just huddled by your fire for a little bit? It's very lovely. I promise I won't touch anything. Uh, hello, I'm Lucian, by the way. If the guards would listen to Viola, they'd have caught the butcher by now. The butcher? Is there a butcher on the run? What have they done? Stolen some sausages? Oh, pardon me. Is that in your way? Oh, no, not at all. Sorry, I'm just standing in your living room, trying to warm up. I hope someday we'll get to know each other better. Uh, yes. I, uh, I hope so, too. One day, when we're not <clears throat> total strangers. Uh, anyway, uh, look, I saw a dragon flying around outside a little moment ago. Aren't you at all worried about those? Those dragons? I used to say. There ain't no use worrying about the things you can't change. I suppose that's fair. It's my fate to be ended by a dragon. So be it. Meantime, I'll live my life the way I want to. Oh, well, that's a very optimistic viewpoint. I Sometimes wish you well. the difference between life and death is a swift steed. Yes, now that can be true, but in my experience, I have found that a swift steed can in fact get you a lot closer to the death side of that if the steed in question is throwing you from its back at high speed onto the ground. Just, just my experience throughout life, you know, has taught me that lesson, which is why generally I prefer to walk, but it really is most kind of you to let us stay in your house for a little while, don't you think? Gore, Lydia, yes, we're really very, very grateful to you for allowing us to warm up for a bit. Although, come to think of it, I'm still rather chilly, so I hope you don't mind if we just intrude upon your company for a little moment longer. Would that be all right, you know? See why the Nords like Skyrim. This crisp air is wonderful for the lungs. Isn't it? Horses. All day long. <laughs> Do you have any idea how dull horses are? Well, that does rather raise the question why exactly you work in a stables. Seems a strange life choice, but then to each their own, you know, not judging you at all for choosing to work with an animal you find so dull. I hope someday we'll get to know each other better. Yes, you, you said that already. I'm so sorry to be standing in your house for so long. It's lovely, though. If the guards would listen to Viola, nice open plan layout. I like the way the, uh, the wardrobe... It's almost in the corner, but not quite. Good, good design, and um, the way you keep your axe and your saw and your flute all on the same shelves. These are all the important things. Yes. And I suppose you just go outside if you ever feel the call of nature. I love my husband, but he can be a bit dull at times. Uh, he's literally standing right there. Isn't that a rather rude thing to say about your husband who loves you? Or I assume loves you. Uh, do you know what? I think I'll drop that right there. Uh, what's that? Little Timmy's fallen down a well? What well? And who's Timmy? You do say the strangest things. Uh, anyway, um, perhaps I'll go and have a chat with Gore. Hello, Just Gore. Remember, everything's better bloody. Right. Is there anything on your mind? Have you ever heard of Clan Fear? Lizard beasts from oblivion taste like chicken, or so I've been told. They sound delicious. Let's go. Well then, I think that's enough waiting around here. Let's have a go at making our way to that bandit camp. Right then, off we go. Let's see, have we got anything that I might be able to use to keep me warmer on the way. Yes, a torch. That'll help. Gosh, another battle! Best stay clear if we can. Looks like the Imperials are winning. Good to see. Now then. This weather is frankly deadly. So we'll have to be very careful. If we get caught out for too long, it'll be curtains. Wolves! Hopefully they'll stay back. I'm warning you. Stay back. Stay back. Yes, I think they're... No, no, they're determined to cause trouble. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry I have to do this. Phew! Right. Torch. Just have to stay as warm as possible, and if there's any shelter on the way, we'll have to dive into it. If we can... 
gosh, what was that? More fighting. Can we stay clear? We just rush past. We just duck behind this chap doing all that shooting. There we are. We through, we're through, we're through. Right. Come on, team. Draugr! Two! Out and about? No, I think on this occasion, time to run. Or maybe it would be a good time to try out that bone spirit spell. It's working! It seems rather effective. Yes! Marvellous! Oh, these must be the spirits. Fascinating. Well then. Let's just take anything they've got that's helpful. Thank you. And then come along, team. How does it work, this spell? I don't quite understand it. But anyway. Perhaps we'll be able to find shelter in here. Hello. Ares the boss. You should talk to her if you want work. Right. Uh, I wonder if I, they'll let me in. Uh, hello. Hello. Anybody there? No. Well, perhaps we'll try one of these other houses. Uh, I'll step behind them. Maybe we can just hop over here. No one will notice. Right. Hello? No one home. Well, that's not ideal. I really did want to be able to shelter. Oh dear, getting cold. I really don't want to freeze out here. Hmm. I work at the mill. Drop trees, Perhaps. carry logs, sow lumber. You know. Strangers are always trouble. Perhaps they'll let us gather some firewood at least. Maybe? Do you mind? Do you mind, sir, if I just, uh... No, I don't... I can't... You're not gonna let me borrow your axe? Right, then. I suppose there's nothing for it. We'll just have to press on. Ah! An axe! Well, no one seems to be using it. Perhaps I'll just borrow it for a moment. I could just borrow a few of these logs and make a fire. So when you kill this that would help me a lot. I was thinking you should try Perhaps I'll sing a cheery song as I chop. Yes, that'll keep us all in good spirits, I'm sure. Oh, chopping wood, chopping wood, and we're really cold. We're chopping wood, chopping wood, and my fingers are numb. This song doesn't rhyme because I'm making it up as I go along. But I'm chopping wood, and I'm really, really cold. Let's chop some more, let's chop some more. We're chopping more wood, chopping wood. And it's really, 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 really cold. One more log, one more log, one more log. Chopping one more log. Yeah. There we are, that'll do. That's enough to be getting on with. Right. I think, actually, we'd better make it here. Getting awfully cold. Oh, gosh. Uh, the old campfire. Here we are. Perhaps here, is that all right? Let's see. Kindling. Add some fuel. Add some wood shavings. Add some tinder. Come on, catch! Gosh, I can hardly feel my fingers. So cold. Gore, is it is it me or is it starting to get a little bit a little bit dark? I'm so tired. So cold and tired. In fact, I think I might just lie down for a moment. I think I think I need to. I need to. 